What's good, non on Dream family? We back at it, episode 42 of the non on Dream journey. My name is Julian Taliaferro. You already know we coming again with another weekly business update, lessons for the week, and topic for the day, which is action. And I'm going to begin with the quote for this week, which is, the body is a terrible master, but a wonderful slave uh, from Dr. Bobby Price. And I think this quote just goes to show that our body is a vessel and it's meant for us to manipulate. So, for example, imagine you're working out, you're at the gym and your body's tired, right? Your body's telling you to quit. But if you mentally tell your body that you want to go 10 more, 15 more reps, then your body will do that, right? You just have to strongly you know, and have that, that mental strength to tell your body to, to undergo that and basically be your slave. Right. So, again, the quote is the body is a terrible master, but a wonderful slave uh, from Dr. Bobby Price. So now I can get into my business update and it's really just more continued work on my startup. Um, a highlight is that I've been able to make a more thorough uh, version to prototype of my marketplace and some of its functions. And I did that using Visibly, which is a, a great platform uh, for prototypes and things like that. Uh, also, when it comes to being in San Antonio and trying to build my, my network and, you know, meeting other founders and things like that, I think I'm going to get tapped into a co-working space that's right in downtown. It's called Geekdom and um, it's, it's for startups. So, you know, I'm going to try to go in there and start working there when I get back from work and things like that. And hopefully it'll allow me to be a little bit more productive uh in my startup because you know I'm in the environment and things like that but also I hope that it'll help me build community and I can meet other founders uh, that are grinding as well so that's my business update and now I can get into my lessons for the week and I just have uh, one of them for this episode and it's, it's real simple and it's just to uh, build on each day um, so this is just me realizing that you know I might have one good day you know but that's not enough you know, I need to have two good days, right? Two days isn't good enough. I need three good days and just keep trying to stack it and stack it and stack it. That way I can build on the work and I can build on my momentum. Uh, so that's the lesson for the week. Uh, build on each day. So now I can get to my topic, which is action. And uh, the, the reason for the topic is because the other day I was thinking about success and what does that look like to me, right? Am I successful right now? Uh, how long will it take for me to become successful and things like that. And I basically had to determine what is my definition of success. So I ended up, I was writing in my journal and I realized that for me, success is taking action. So for me, it's waking up every single day and taking action to make my family a generational wealth, uh, taking action to build my 99 dream, right? Taking action to build my startup, um, uh, Therefore, you know, I was able to realize that I'm successful already. I'm, ex I'm successful right now. I'm successful the moment I wake up and I begin thinking about my business. And no matter how the day goes, uh, good, bad, you know, whatever occurs, you know, no matter how tough it is, uh, I will always be successful as long as I have that correct mindset and I am taking action. So no matter how big or small the step that I take during the day is, you know, it doesn't matter, right? Because I'm trying. And, you know, I've heard a lot of times that sometimes it doesn't matter about your effort or it doesn't matter if you're trying, if there is no end result to that, you know, if you don't get something tangible. But that's not how I personally feel. Um, I think that at the end of the day, you know, what else can I do other than just put my effort into it? What else can I do than dedicate energy, dedicate time? And, you know, put it all on the line. And all I can do is just have faith, uh, put the work in, and then God will re reveal the end result, right? And I know that when I die, I'll be able to lay my head peacefully down and tell myself that I took action, right? Uh, no matter the results, right? I took action on a day-to-day -day basis. So uh, this doesn't mean that I can't improve on my actions, right? I'm not saying that just because I'm successful now that I can't get better, Um you know, I can always improve my actions, but that just means that I'll need to become a better executor, right? And the way that I become a better executor is by taking more and more action, right? And, you know, how will I become 
or how will I know how to execute if I don't take action, right? Execution is a, a lesson that's learned, um, you know, through the process or steps that you take. Uh, let's say in your business or in your life, you know, you learn that and you learn how to execute. So, um, you know, it's something that I can improve on, right? But the basis for me and the main thing for me right now, especially just that I'm taking action, no matter what it looks like on a day-to-day -day basis, uh, just knowing that I'm in the right headspace and I'm growing, right? Uh, the moment that I'm in right now is the moment that I'm supposed to, that I'm supposed to be in, right? I'm not supposed to be anywhere more or uh, any less, right? I'm perfectly right where I'm supposed to be and, you know, I'll get to what I want to achieve on the time that God has laid out for me, right? So I just got to continue taking action. So that's the topic. Um, and next steps for me are just to continue working on my startup. Uh, big things for me are my customer interviews, uh, diving in on that. Um, and then I think I want to start building on my landing page as well for, for my startup. So, uh, all right, let's get it, y'all. Going to achieve your 99 dream. And it's 99 dream because you are going to achieve your dream. And it would be 100%, but nobody, nothing is perfect. So you're going to achieve 99% of that. And let's go and let's get it.